do with all the money in the world? What a question. I know what I'd do. Do you want to know what I'd do? No. <laughs> I'd never do laundry again. That's it? That's the big dream? Among other things. Do you want to hear a little story? About rich people? Yes. Always. There was a certain king named Midas, net worth 100 billion. Now, I'm not a greedy man, but it is an accepted fact, a, a proven fact, that money is a good thing. A thing to be longed for, and necessary. And my god, I have a lot of it. <laughs> it wasn't always this way with me, the boats, the houses by the sea, the summer cottages and winter palaces, the exotic furnishings, the soft clothes, the food, and... Honey, can you stop that now? Be still. Daddy's talking. Excuse me. The outrageous food in 200-year-old wine. No, it wasn't always like this. I came up from poor, and I worked hard all my life. Still do, mind you. My father was in a modern manufacturing somewhere. But I was born with a head for business. It's always been like everything I've touched has turned to gold. Not literally, of course. Wouldn't that be something? A turn to profit, I mean. Sweetheart, Daddy asked you, be still. Take it inside. You see this pool? It cost a pretty penny, I can tell you. But all it takes is hard work, plain and simple. Those who haven't got it in them? Well then, what can anyone do? They just haven't got it. Be still, you're driving me nuts already. But you know, I never forget that I do it all for my, it's all for the, uh, for the, um, uh, for the fit. Yes, that's what it's all for. Family is the most important thing, isn't it? I get home at midnight, seven days a week. In the moments before sleep, I realize that, what was that? Oh yes, my family is what really matters. Yes, sir. Yes, what is it? This man's been causing trouble in town. We believe he's a vagrant, sir, of the work. The most drunken kind. Okay. What do we do? <laughs> nice place. Execute him. No need, no need. In my day, I've certainly been three sheets to the wind. Three sheets to the wind? what the hell are you talking about? I'm all rummed up. Even last week, a feast for us. No, listen, let me tell you something. You know what? No. Let, what? let me tell you. Yes? Let me tell you. Yes, something. what is it? I've been all over the world. Oh, have you? Yes. I'm lost now, but I have been all over this place. Mm, how nice for you. Do you listen? Well, let me tell you, there's a country beyond this. Very place. interesting, but I really no, have no, to. No, no, listen. I strayed from the path, I've lost out, but there is a country. Africa? Further. Asia. Further still, I've been there. Oh. King, I tell you, a second dream. I am telling you that in this place, the people, they, they see each other, and they live without desire, and so time? <laughs> there is no time. Just the blue sky up above, and the pretty moon next to it. <laughs> Look out the meadows beneath their feet, the pretty little flowers. Well, thank you, this has been most entertaining, but <laughs> I really- The people live forever. What? No other people, they never die. What? What is it? A summer herb they have? No, 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 no. Something in the air? Something we could distill? I have shipping fleets, you know, they bring it. Uh, no, it's, uh... Yes? Not your daughter? What? Yes! Go on! Get out of here! Be still for once in your life. Go on, go on. No, you're rich indeed. Yeah, go on, he's an animal. Oh, better still, if it's an animal, we could breed them here. I call the millions. Don't worry, young man, you'll get your cut. No, no, no. It's not an animal. Then what is it? What is the secret to eternal life? It's here. Some formula you have. The formula? No, no, no. It's here. What? And here. Oh, that. The inner life. <laughs> what uselessness. Well, go on, you may sleep in the cabana. Thank you! Now turn him over! For God's sake, somebody turn him over before he drowns! Night fell, and the rosy fingered dawn came back again. Midas? The Lord is there! Miss Bacchus, I, uh, heard you have a follower of mine? 
follower? Yes. Oh, still Anis. He wandered from our group as we passed close to town. And, uh, I heard he was with you. Oh, the fellow in the cabana. Yes, take him. He's all yours. I'm grateful that you didn't turn him away, Midas. That you took care of him and saw that he didn't drown in his condition. And I'd like to present you with a little gift. A gift? Some ability. A minor miracle. Something to do at parties? Any. Anything at all. You promise? Yes, of course. You can grant me that everything I touch, everything I put my hands to, will turn to solid gold. That's a really, really bad idea. <laughs> what? What are you talking about? It's a brilliant idea! Think about it, Midas. No, you think about it. You gave your oath. We had a deal, for God's sake. Now follow through. All right, then. <laughs> And from that moment on, everything we touch turns to solid gold. Wait a minute. Wait a minute, let me think. Uh, where to begin? He went out walking, and with every step, the gravel under his feet turned to golden nuggets. Delighted, he put his hands to the branches of trees and flowers. And he had gold branches and flowers. All day long, he experimented. Almost insane with happiness. But the whole of the world becomes a personal treasure. Late at night, he stumbled back into the courtyard, laden with precious gold. Daddy! No! Take it away! Take it away now! I can't. You can't, you must! Bacchus, take it away! I'm sorry. Take it away now! There's only one way, Midas. What is it? Walk as far as the ends of the earth. There you will find a pool that reflects the stars at night. Wash your hands in the water, and everything will be restored. Is that too sad for you? A little. All right, then. Here's another. <laughs> 